Okay, hi everyone, welcome back. Today we're gonna to look at proportions uh, using word problems. So if you've completed the proportions video as well as converting units video, uh, today's lesson will be a lot easier on you. So we're gonna round our answers to two decimal places for all of the problems and examples. So example one, James drove 250 kilometers in 3.2 hours. How long will it take him to drive 430 kilometers? So what we have is our first ratio of 250 kilometers for 3.2 hours. And this is going to be the same as 430 kilometers in a certain amount of hours, which we'll call x. So our goal here is to isolate x. So from our proportions video, we remember that this is equivalent to the flip, like that. And then we're going to go times 430 on both sides to isolate x. So 3.2 times 430 divided by 250 gives 5.5. And so our answer here is five and a half hours. And we circle that like that. So just a little tip. Take a look and think about how you want to set up the proportion. You can save yourself some time. So here, if we thought about it ahead of time, we would have written it as x over 430 right away. We can do that. And so we're going to do that same thing in example two. So Jordan has an internet connection that allowed him to download 150 megabits in 12 seconds. How long in minutes will it take him to download 2025 megabits? And so instead of writing 150 over 12, we're going to write 12 seconds over 150, which gives unknown seconds over 2025. And so now it's easier. We can go times 2025 on both sides. And so X is 162 seconds. And so we want to convert seconds into minutes. So we have one minute over 60 seconds. The seconds cancel out, which gives 2.7 minutes. We're going to convert the 0.7 minutes back to seconds. So 0.7 minutes times 60 over 1, right? The minutes cancel out, which gives 42 seconds. So our answer here is 2 minutes and 42 seconds. Okay, example 3. A TV has a ratio of 16 by 9, so 16 width by 9 height. If the TV has a width of 20 inches, what is the height? So we're going to go 9 over 16, and unknown is x, which is the height, over 20, which is the width. And so we go times 20 to both sides, and so we get x equals 11.25. And so the height is 11.25 inches. Okay, time for some practice. So practice number one, I'll read the question with you. Jill is filling her pool. She has filled up 246 liters in three minutes. How much will she have filled after 45 minutes? So go ahead and pause the video and answer that. Okay, we're back. And so we have 246 for every three minutes is unknown for 45 minutes. We go times 45 both sides, and x is 3690. And so the amount is 3690 liters, like that. Practice number two. Jack is recharging his phone. He recharged 30% in 45 minutes. How long will it, how long until his phone is fully charged? Go ahead and pause the video and answer that. Okay, we're back. So we have 45 minutes gives 30%. Unknown minute gives 100%. So times 100 both sides get X on its own, which is 150. So we have 150 minutes. Convert into hours. So one hour over 60 minutes cancels the minutes. So we get 2.5 hours. We convert the 0.5 hours back to minutes. So minutes over hour. Hours cancel out. 0.5 times 60 gives 30 minutes like that. So the total time is 2 hours and 30 minutes. Practice number 3. Janet goes to the gym and follows this ratio. 10 minutes of workout to 3 minutes of rest. If she worked out for 45 minutes, what is her total rest time? So go ahead and pause the video and answer that.
Okay, so we have three minutes of rest to 10 minutes working out, unknown minutes of rest to 45 minutes of working out, times 45 both sides, and so x is 13.5. So 13.5 minutes of rest. And that's it. It's that easy. I'll see you guys in the next video.